Word. Geo, I stole your fucking car, bro. I'm about to drive this shit into that fountain right now. I feel like I got socked in the face right there. But anyways, guys, happy new year. I hope you guys have your goals set. I hope you guys are working on them, and I hope that you guys stick to them. I know as far as us and the rest of Team Tuned in Tokyo, we have a lot in store for 2018. We have our goals set. We have our minds right. You know, like Frankie said in the last video, we're going to be uploading four to five vlogs every week. We are not going to let you guys down. I will start building my RX-7. I promise you guys I'm going to start building it this week, actually, in a couple days. Today, though, what we actually have going on is me and Gio have to go to our venue at the Nas Center. We gotta sign the contract, make sure everything's legit, so that way we can start promoting the event. We have a lot of other things planned for today too. We're gonna be testing under the hood. We gotta make sure we get all the camera angles right, the lighting right. I know we did that before in the past, but we took so much time off of vlogging and content. You know, we kind of gotta get back into the rhythm of things and get everything, you know, 2.0. So we're gonna work on that today. I'm sure there's a couple other things that are gonna pop up in the day, like they always do. Let's head to the warehouse and get the day started. You got any car parts for me? Turn left. Oh, I said turn left. That's all right. I didn't want any car parts anyways. So I made it to the warehouse. I am a little late. I haven't been in front of the camera in a while. So yeah, I was that guy like looking in my mirror, basically talking to myself, looking all dumb. But it's okay because I haven't done this in a while. Had to get the bugs out of my system. Let's see if they say anything. What's up, ladies? <laughs> wow. I took took Frankie's line. <laughs> What's up, baby? What's going on, y'all? What's up? You guys call like each other fucking twins or what? It's a buy one, get one free hoodie sale right now. Hey, one. You ready to go, though? I'm ready to go, bro. Let's go. Uh, my bad, I was late. I had to practice in front of the mirror, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I thought oh, yeah. we were going to Evo, and now we're going to Kia, bro. That's just pussy repellent, bro. Let's go. <laughs> Is there a chick magnet today? Hey, you down and drive though? Now they're shoot. Yeah, let's go. Big ass piss, bro. <laughs> you like, oh, fuck. Oh, shit. You're like, fuck, I don't want to say it. Oh, fuck. It was green. We just got to the venue. I believe we said it in our last video, but we're gonna be throwing our show at the NOS Center now. So we're meeting with the owner of the NOS Center right now. The quote he gave us for the venue is a little on the high side. We wanna see what we can do to get those those numbers down. We also wanna go in, scope out the venue, kind of plan out the layout. So we're going in right now and we'll see how it goes. I'm not gonna show you guys the whole venue, but I will show you the speedway part, which is basically like the middle of the entire venue. It's fucking badass. So March 24th, it's gonna go down here at the NOS Center. Really excited to have you guys. You guys uh, just gotta go to www.tuneintokyoevents.com, register or buy your spectator tickets now. So we're just checking out the venue right here with Brian, with our boy Ishmael. Give us some love, man. Then all of our competitors are gonna hit up Ishmael and take our spot. <laughs> <laughs> we're excited to see how this turns out. So we can't wait to see you guys March 24th. If you wanna be like actually driving inside. Yeah, that, that that's like be. insurance off the roof. And then you can have uh, any pedestrians. And it's all, yeah, all this space is like, they gotta be out there. You can't really tell, the camera doesn't do it justice, but the speedway is pretty freaking big. Good news and bad news didn't go exactly like I would have hoped for. You know, in all reality, we didn't get the price lowered at all. We're actually paying a little more than we originally thought. So it's not the best case scenario, but we're gonna make it work. The show's gonna be fucking insane. Figuring out the layout with Gio is cool. Being able to see, you know, where we're gonna put the cars, the vendors. I never saw the venue before. Uh, Gio and Frankie actually went a couple days ago, so that was cool to see. But all in all, it's gonna be a dope show. The scenery is insane the speedway is by far the best part of the show make sure that you guys pre-register because all the people that pre-register and especially the VIP car registrations you guys are gonna be right at smack in the middle of the speedway so make sure you guys don't procrastinate on that there's a limited space for VIP it's gonna sell out first yeah I think we only have like 50 spots or something like that so don't procrastinate make sure that you guys get on it now we got to head back to the warehouse though we got to get the rest of our day started but we're off to a late start now that we had to stop by here 
here, but we're actually going to be doing a car review of Gio's car, of his Evo. If you guys haven't seen it yet, I'm sure you guys have on all our ads right now. We're heading back to the warehouse. Let's get the day started. We're still waiting for this light to turn green. <laughs> We've been here We've for been like fucking 10, 10 minutes. minutes. We just realized with Brian that we just got fucked long dick style. Like from here to March 24th, we're getting fucked on this venue. I don't know if we should say that though because <laughs> they're gonna, gonna be see like, it. Well, if you wanna get <laughs> fucked, I'll fuck you bro. I'll just cancel this shit on you. All right, well, they're very generous and they've used Vaseline on us. <laughs> shit, I don't even know, bro. <laughs> I told them, I was like, yo, bro, can you use some spit? Like, you know, spit on it or something, bro. This fool's been watching too much porn lately. I haven't watched porn. I just, yeah, Brian inspires me every he day. He don't need to. Hey, but on a serious note, guys, we were just fucking around. The, the event, the Ishmael, the guy that we were talking to at the Knot Center, super cool guy. Appreciate everything he's doing for us. He's actually helping us to the best of his ability. He's following the rules, and we gotta follow the rules too. And we're gonna make this show happen. It's gonna be a banger. Look at this guy right here, dude. 28 years to make, baby. What's up? <laughs> Dude, still let's doesn't go. <laughs> what the fuck? We need to make a right. Let's go right. Fuck this. Bro, this fucking place. It had to get one last fucking booty slap. Right. <laughs> Shout out to Ranger. I'll take a meat lover's hamburger, please. <laughs> Call Rancho Cucamonga PD, bro. Ryan's in jail. I'm on my way to pick him up right now. They're, they're Nigga, they took him. No, they really started. Did you guys go to the back? Yeah, bro. Yes. We just came back from there. It's not good news, bro. Anyways, okay. I got Ryan back. I bailed him out. Me and Gio just got back to the warehouse. The rest of the guys aren't here. Just Martin in the back shipping some orders out. Where everybody else is right now is they're actually doing the car review on Gio's car. Basically, to bring it back to you guys, three, four months ago when we were originally testing under the hood we were going to do it all in like one big show and it was gonna be the car review cinematics of the car the interview of the guests but we actually decided that we're gonna split that up into two videos we just feel like that would be better because you know you guys don't want you guys got a lot going on you guys don't want to sit and watch a 45 minute one hour video so we're gonna separate that into one video which is gonna be the podcast of us interviewing our guests and basically talking about what they do for a living how they're able to afford the parts on their car as well as actually Actually getting down to the specs and mods that they've done to their car what the second video is going to be is basically the review of the car so for instance Gio drives a Evo 10 like just an honest review on the Evo 10 and everything that he's done to it but I'm gonna wait for them to get back I got a lot of office work I gotta knock out right now and then when they get back probably gonna work on the podcast making sure everything's straight me and Gio are out here putting in work Gio, I stole your fucking car bro I'm about to drive this shit Fuck you. Damn, you guys finally made it back? Yo, the mission, man. A few situations. Dude, I, had I was like, don't get home. here at 5, and so you guys get here at like 4.50. Right. Swift, what the fuck, man? It's already getting dark. Swim Daddy, what's up, baby? Oh my what's up, big dog? I'm supposed to call me Geo Daddy, bro. Oh, I'm sorry, Geo Daddy. The good news is that we did all the You guys got bakers, there. too? Yeah. Bro, so you guys got it figured out now though. Yeah. You just yeah. need the audio piece. Me and Brian been working all day. These niggas just got to work. It's 3.30, bro. <laughs> no, it's like almost 5. It's you like 4.30. It's a minimum day, dog. Exactly. Minimum day. Hey, Gio. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Yeah. I, the psycho ex girl turned you gay? Straight life, nigga. The things that happen here at Tune in Tokyo, guys. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, I need my Nas too. Yeah, Actually. see, bro, you fucking up. Bring it. Damn, Nas is life. Look at the Nas. <laughs> How many people need Nas? You guys want cherry, grape, just classic Nas? What do you guys want? Nas is. Nas is. Nas galore. Ah! We got cherried out butt blood right here. Butt blood. Dude, you guys sound like you're saying butt blood. <laughs> <laughs> butt blood. Shout out, you know what it do. You guys can hear me? Yeah. Gio, say something. Yo, yo, yo. Damn, Swift over here with the lights. Do I look pale? Gio, let me know if you guys can hear me. I got you, I got you. So Brian, Frankie, and Jiro, they're in the podcast room. I'm gonna go to Home Depot and pick up some paint and some supplies so we can go ahead and get the back painted. So I'm at Home Depot, I'm gonna find this paint aisle. Just got five gallons of some all white semi-gloss, so hopefully that's enough to paint the back. Last stop for the night, and we are always here, I swear. Harbor Freight. I'm actually going into Harbor Freight to pick up a palm sander because I'm actually building this display table that we're gonna set up in our showroom, and it's really, really smooth, and we also wanna paint it in black, so in order for me to paint it for the paint to stick i need to kind of give it a rough texture so that's the reason i'm here this this will do the trick now we just need to buy some sandpaper pads for the sander and then we should be good i haven't just got back right now with all the stuff that we needed we finished off the podcast it actually went really good we're still trying to figure out like where everyone should sit it's kind of awkward because we're just like looking sideways at the guests the entire time but you know we'll figure that out with a couple trial runs but i am extremely excited to get this content going getting the podcast the car reviews educational videos vlogs we have so much coming your way and i'm just extremely excited to get it started all right guys it's the end of the day there's a lot of just random stuff and a lot that I had to fill you in on for the next couple weeks. You know, since we took so much time off of vlogging, probably gonna have to update you on everything that's going on, which is cool. We got a lot going on this year and we want you guys to be involved in everything that we do. I'm gonna end the vlog for today. Just so you guys know, I do have a lot in the works with the RX-7. I've already ordered a lot of parts and I'll talk to you guys more about that in a couple days when I go back there and start working on it again. So like every video, we do a giveaway and I think in the last vlog that we just did, we forgot to do the giveaway winner so I'm gonna pick two right now the first one is and the second winner so congratulations to both of you remember guys every video we do a giveaway make sure that you comment on this video and we'll pick a winner in the next one make sure that you guys like and subscribe tell all your friends and until next time peace out riders on the storm riders on the storm